Hi subbies, how you all doing? Yes, I'm in a completely different part of my bedroom today. I've decided because I've moved Lucy's doll's house as she's currently playing with it, I've moved it, I've got room for my tripod to put by my window where the lighting is on point. So today I decided I'm gonna film in front of my window as it's just different to where I normally film. At the back looks scruffy, I know. I've got bag, I've got holes to film, I've got stuff to do in my bedroom. But I've also got to get this video up on time for you guys because I've been doing really, really rubbish recently with getting my pulled, getting videos up on time. I'm sorry about that. It's just been stuff like hospital appointments coming up and I've been getting stuff like doing stuff for work, etc. So today is going to be a Primark haul. This video is actually from Payday. Um, I went to Primark twice. I only bought a couple of items. I said in the vlog that um, it might end up being a trend haul. Unfortunately, it's not going to be a trend haul, mainly because I've only got so many items of clothing and I do not, um, I will be showing you pictures, like, like, I don't know, but I will have pictures up of me in the outfits, but not in this video, as it's not going to be a trend haul because I've just not got the room in the bedroom at the moment, not got, I've got the time, but it's just not enough um, outfits in this, but we'll have Primark train hauls soon. Or late, sooner or later. So today is going to be Primark haul. I'm really excited to show you one of the specific, no, two items I am super chuffed with. So yeah, let's get on with this haul. First item you will have seen in my bag. I mean, in the thumbnail. And this is the Mickey Mouse bag. I decided it was payday. I actually got paid a bonus this month. Um, Last month. No, this month. I got paid a bonus. I decided that's it. I need a new bag for, bag for work. I need a new handbag. This one is super cute. I'm really chuffed with this. This was £14 from the Disney section in Primark. This is one in Leeds, as that's the only Primark I've ever been to. But it is super cute. I'm super chuffed with it. It's got these really cute uh, Minnie Mouse balls. It's got, which has got like self, like protectiveness around it. I don't know what that is. Um, stars mickey mouse icons it's super adorable has this really cute gold zip with the little pouch at the front and i obviously don't normally go for black but i have had an eye on the i have had my eye on this bag for quite a long time and i just can't tell you how much i love this bag it's super cute it's gonna hold my bottle my purse my bags etc it's gonna hold stuff and it's also gonna be my holiday bag this year for my handbag for holiday as i've decided um, that bag it just it just needs to go because I've had it quite a while now and it's just getting to the point where it's not really doing its job anymore. Um, well, that's a lie, but oh, it's got a scruff mark on it. Oh well, I'll try and get it off. But it also has the Mickey Mouse ears, which is super adorable, and it's just a small handbag, so it's got the straps at the back as well. But yes, guys, I'm super chuffed with this. It's also inside got a pouch, a zip at the back for where I put my period pads in my bag. And just a lot of room for stuff as well. So I decided, yes, gonna get it. And I just cannot believe how cute it is. I really like it. And I'm really quite chuffed. I splashed out in that brand new handbag. So now into my actual bag. This is the Jackals one I got from Christmas. I use this like a lot now because it's a handbag. It is actually supposed to be a overnight bag. But I decided I'm gonna use it for shopping as it holds quite a lot. So... I got some shorts. This was when it was very hot weather and it was nice and hot. This was from last week shopping. I went shopping on Tuesday, Wednesday. I went shopping on Wednesday to Leeds and I decided to get myself some shorts without looking at the size stupidly. Didn't look at the size of it. Turns out it is a size six to eight. It's a extra small. So, I'm going to have to take these back. I might actually just um, swap them or get something new. But these are just basic, um, they're not denim. They are the basic fabric shorts. And it just has a little stitch in the corner. So that's why I bought them. These were only £4, which is actually rather cheap. As to have um, basic um, grey shorts like these, for 4 quid as well. But I wanted some, just some different ones. So I decided these ones. Didn't look at the price. Didn't look at the um, size. And I stupidly bought them too small the do fit around the waist which is rather worrying but they are tight and they actually come up way too far to my hip as well so i'm going to be taking these back to get a refund or to swap them but yeah i got some shorts that is one of the reasons why i'm not going to try and haul they were four pound i then oh my gosh i love this top 
Um, I then got myself an off-the-shoulder top. I love this. I tried it on when I got home. It looks amazing. I'm just thinking about getting a different bra for it because I don't actually want to strap so I'm really bothered. If Put your comments below, guys. Um, this might sound like a weird suggestion, but what do you do when you get off the shoulder tops? Do you get like a bando, uh, whatever you want to call them, bras, or do you just not bother and just not bother with straps? Just tell me in the comments below. You don't have to, don't worry. But I'm just saying that. Um, but yeah, it goes really cute. Pale, it's like a peachy pale pink colour. It actually does have stripes down the middle, but it's like, it's not coloured stripes. It is, I don't know what you'd call it. It's just a pattern. Um, where it's been sewn but I love this top I absolutely adore this top I haven't had enough shoulder top for a while I'm keeping this this was only four pound I think yeah this is four pound medium size 10 to 12 12 14 and it fits and I love this top guys and taking some holiday with me um, I've had a comment saying why I don't like reuse my tops or clothing from um, last year's holiday I do I did comment back to you but I do um, I sometimes, like when I've gone through my wardrobe, like I've done decluttering, I've donated things like these bags down here for um, Otley BH, BH, BHF, but it's Heart Foundation. I always donate to them knowing that I've got what I think is a Dodger hat. Um, but I donate all clothes, I donate all my, like I just go through and declutter my wardrobe of stuff that I do not wear anymore and that I'm not going to wear. It's, either I've outgrown it or it's too big and I just know I'm not going to wear it. So I do donate a lot of clothes and then I buy more because obviously I need more summer outfits, outfits like this top which as I said really happy with. This is one of the summer tops and I'm super chuffed I bought it. Um, I will be wearing it on holiday most definitely. I just feel so girly, girly in this and as I said it's summery that's why I bought this. So that was only £4. It's because they've got their own like cropped stuff at the front of the shop now which is rather good. Um, so they've all got, they've got some really nice off the shoulder tops and crop tops and tops which hardly cover any of your body at all tops if you like. The next top I got is this um, vest top. I decided I was going to get a vest top as I like them, the flowy. These ones are especially flowy whereas the Mickey Mouse one and the Minnie Mouse one I got from last year, they aren't flowy, they're like sculpture the body if you like. But this one is a vacation mod on. I just liked it. And it's got um, airplanes on it, cameras, handbags, ice creams, hats, etc. It's a nice, <coughs> sorry, it's a nice top. It's a size small because I know medium sometimes sometimes is way too big for me. But I did get a nice vest top. I might even crop it eventually, but I like it. Super cheap. It was on two pound fifty, and it'll do my holiday when like even of my bikini or whatever. So yeah, I'm really chuffed with that as well. Last outfit, well, last clothing item is this, guys. And I didn't realise this was a dress till I got home. This is what I bought payday. I bought myself a denim dress. And, guys, I love this thing. This, I love this so much. Um, this is basically, as I said, you want, like, a sculpt dress. It, like, this one does suck to my body, though, because it's a size 10. So I'm thinking about getting a size 12, seeing a size 12 fits better, like gives me more room. But this is a size 10, it fits me and I love it. Honest to God, I love this dress so much. Um, I've not bought myself a dress in years, I must say that. Last time I bought a dress was for my 18th birthday and that was such a nice dress. Had to donate it as I got too small, too big for it. Um, but I love this dress, it's super cute. Um, just basic, a basic denim dress and I am super happy with it. I can't really give you more of a like a de like a um detailed look at it because obviously I'm quite close to the camera but you get the gist it is one of the ones which I have to fully open the dress to get into it but oh my gosh guys I love this dress and it was 13 pound so there was a bright neon pink one as well and I was thinking about getting that one but then I thought mm, I'll wear this more often I will definitely wear this dress and I'm super looking forward to wearing it you can always wear it, you can also wear it like without any tops, just on its own. Um, which I've worn it like that and it's, I really liked it. But then somebody else said you can also wear it obviously with the top underneath. Like a long sleeve top or like a short sleeve top. But I don't know guys, tell me in the comments below what would you wear. What would you wear with this? Would you wear this dress on its own or would you wear a top underneath it? 
I personally think on its own because it just looks so nice on its own but tell me in the comments below what you think and if you like it because I absolutely adore it that was all my clothing stuff I then got um for nail vanishes as they brought out a new um range has Primark for their nail vanishes all 150 each I had to get every single colour I told them that till I had to get every colour because honest to god like these are such nice colours so I got um, this cosmic chrome also lightens over here is so much better so fingers crossed the camera will pick up the actual colour and not like horrible um, but this is cosmic chrome and it is um, it doesn't have a colour oh it's called star um, but oh my god guys these are gorgeous colours it is very it's sparkly is this one um, don't know how to say I've got an nail at the moment I haven't put an nail on my fingernails for ages mainly because I'm not had time or because I've just not bothered um, because I do do it after having a bath and after I've doing everything else like washing my hair as in like no do my hair everything else etc but this is a golden um, glittery one like a shimmery one then I have Lucy's really happy in the background then I have coral this is like this is a shimmery pink and this is mermaid magic which kind of sounds like it's a kid's nail varnish. Oh well. Um, this is such a nice, cool colour as well. Like, look at that. I am really wanting to do nail varnish. Like, so happy with these nail varnishes, guys. They're all 150 each. Then I've got Mermaid Magic again. This one's a purple. It's like holographic. This one's called Glitter. Lucy's singing. And then the last one is this basic. Um, I got the Cosmic Chrome in silver and gold. This one is just the silver one. Only 50 each. Super, super chuffed this Primark haul, guys. I am going to buy more outfits when I go to Primark next, which will be next payday, which is rather soon. I'm super excited, guys, for the next couple of hauls I've got up. I've got um, Home Bargains haul, Charity haul, Card Factory haul, um, Morrison's haul, uh, Ecotopia haul, which I did do an Ecotopia vlog. It wasn't the best. It was my first time going to Ecotopia. Such a great shop. I'll leave the website comments below. It's a zero waste shop. They do not use any plastic. It's all in recyclable um, containers like cardboard, paper. It's you all, you take your own, talking too quick here, you take your own containers in actually to fill them up with um, like pasta, oats, hand wash etc it's such a good shop please all look at it it's central arcade in leeds this is not a promotion or a sponsor i just generally love their shop so thank you for watching guys remember to like subscribe comment below please tell me if you like this um setup no it's not the best but it's better lighting thank you guys see you all next time we've got a new video see you all friday guys believe yourself smile bye